Hi, my name is Andy. I'm going to be doing a tutorial today on how to do a 3D animation flip viewer in Android and uh, a nice, real easy library on how to do it. Now, if you are a subscriber to my channel, you may have seen that I published my uh, a pharmacy calculator app in the, in the Play Store a couple weeks ago, and uh, I added this uh, little flip viewer here so that if you or if you needed information, you get this 3D animation right there. Now, because my app uses uh, touch inputs and uh, a sliding library, I implemented this uh, project in a button on the action bar, but uh, the sample video shows that you tap the view and you can get it to flip like that. Um, now, this is real easy to implement. What you will need is uh, the source code which you can't directly download it so uh, what you can do is you can uh, create a <clears throat> go into browse you can actually view the source right here and um, what you want is the one with the com tackle OSS Android animation and you want these two uh, classes and you, you want to basically copy them into a project that you're going to use as uh, a library in your own uh, uh, workspace. Now the author of this is uh, Jen Zeb and I really appreciate him um, the, using this as open source because it made the, it's just super easy how to use this. Um, what I'm going to show you now is how to how to implement it. So I'm going to be publishing this little example here um, this is basically I've imported his uh, library into uh, mine including the main activity because I wanted to view it and uh, here's the source code it's um, nice what's nice about this one is that this library is actually compatible with uh, the support library so you don't need Android um, 4.0 and higher to do this like I've seen on some other flip viewer examples so this one's nice because it it really does implement uh, older devices that it runs on as part of the, the compatibility uh, library so in this example what you need is uh, just one main activity and we're going to do two fragments that are going to be flipping between each other so the main activity it's really not that much um, all you need to do is this bit of code right here um, to add the flip viewer as a library because you're going to need to do that you're going to go into properties Android add it and then the you're going to add it as a library it'll show up there um, once you have it uh, then you can implement this uh, animation factory code right here so this is what's actually going to be doing a transition for you we've selected a left to right uh, flipper and uh, it's just going to do whenever you click on the actual um, well, uh, layout it'll flip the view of the layout so how we have the layout set up is we're going to have two fragments that these just call fragment one and fragment two all there all that's in there is a, is a text view so that's all I have in here and it's just going to say this is fragment one and the uh, the second one is just going to say this is fragment two and we're going to flip between the two of them. Now in the main activity XML we have this view flipper we're going to set it to the default width, we're going to set it as background of black give it an ID and uh, we're going to make it clickable. Now in the example that they give you online um, here so we'll go to lay out here and check out their main XML you have these image views that are clickable however we can't do that with fragments fragments are not clickable so we can't just say Android clickable it doesn't come up so what we have to use is actually the view flipper and make that clickable and that actually works out very well anyway so uh, just one line of code prevents you from having to repeat it on the other ones so it's actually very nice uh, this is a nice easier way to implement this and then uh, each fragment what I've done is I've uh, uploaded 
as well the <clears throat> library I used to or the layout I used for the rounded corners the rounded corners are just right here in this corner is radius of 20 DIP and uh, I've also we want to set the background of the each card since I've set the background of the view flipper to black uh, each one of these to white and then the little um, border that I have is just a five pixel border with uh, a gray background so when we uh, launch this you'll see you have this as the layout and to make sure that all your code for the fragments are correct uh, I found this very helpful with uh, debugging before actually trying to run the project if you right click on on the layout and say fragment layout and then if this doesn't pull up anything there's something wrong with your code but you should pull up um, your fragment so this is what it's going to look like on the device it's going to say fragment one and when we click on it it's going to flip to fragment two all right but as far as viewing fragment two on here that's not gonna you can't do it in uh, just in this little snapshot view so when we run the application which I already have it loaded so We'll just load it up on here. Oh, sorry, it's right here. We load it up on here. When we click it, it's going to do a little animation to fragment two and fragment one. So, hope this tutorial is very helpful to you. Again, uh, thank you, Gen Zeb, for uh, putting out the library for everybody to use. It's very helpful, and it provides a nice little neat um, layout that you can. Uh, put into your own project. Now, um, like I said, I put mine in, in the action bar and it's very easy to do. Basically, what you would do is create your um, menu inflator and then uh, on your items or on click, you would put an icon in your menu and then uh, put this line of code right here, just that, into each item, into your uh, action bar um, um, menu selection so when you you don't need to actually put any of this because that's all part of the uh, each item inside the action bar so all you need is this this is your on click and that's all you're going to need to flip it all right i hope this helps and have a good day